Hey guys, welcome back to another episode of American Fish Dude Fishing. And today we're going to go to the lake. But it's like 10 foot waves and it looks like someone pooped all over it. So we're going to be at the bridge today. We're fishing, or I'm fishing so far with a bobber and I got one on the bottom right here next to the wall. We're going to see if we can hook up to a blue reel or two and I'm going to cut them up for bait and toss them in and we'll get some catfish and drum and maybe just maybe a bowfin so stay tuned and we'll see what we can do yeah all right guys so i was reeling in my bottom rod that i just kind of threw it over there and let me not stab while doing this this little yellow bullhead decided to take a bite at it Let me get him unhooked. Still trying to catch that bluegill so we can use him as bait. Hooked you right in the top of the mouth. That's that's really good. <laughs> Usually they ain't like that. These things like the swallow hooks, like you would not believe. Alright, there we go. Got it out. This is just a little guy. Probably about seven inches, but a good yellow ball head nonetheless. Fish number two of the day is another yellow bullhead. And this one swallowed the hook. And you gotta watch for the fins on these guys. They will do some damage to you. All right, cool, there we go. This one has some very interesting colors on the top, that's cool. And this one, this one swallowed the hook. So, I'm going to cut the line, get a picture, and then we'll get them back in the water. As my friend, as the biggest fish of the day so far, it's about a 12 inch yellow bullhead. Yellow bullhead have the white whiskers on the bottom, the browns and the blacks have black whiskers on the bottom. That is the easiest way to tell the difference. Oh, I just dropped down a piece of a cut bait. And I got me a large mouth. That's a decent size out of here. 10 inches. I'm going to get the players, get that hook out, and we'll get him back in the water. He ate it. Oh, he's going, he's going. He came off. Uh, I Did he? Yeah, let's no, it's a, little, it's a little one. It's a little one. Oh, yeah. It is me, man. Oh, it's a bowfin. Oh, that's cool. I just lost a small bowfin. That's neat. I'm on with, I think it's a bowfin. Literally like two seconds after the other one. Yeah, get him in, get him in. Get him in. Bring him right over here, buddy. Yeah. Sure. Or not, don't even need the net. <laughs> yeah. I was just there for protection, just, just in case it broke. Alright. That's a little bowfin. That's really cool. Oh, that'd be awesome in a fish tank. <laughs> <laughs> that looks sweet. That'd be awesome. He'd, he'd do some damage to the other fish. But he is going to go back. This is just a very small bowfin. This would be a perfect size for a catch and cook. So. Yeah. We're going to have those in the video. Or not, in the, not in the video. Oops. Shortly, we're gonna have catching cooks with all the species around here, so that'll be. All right, here he goes. And I'm gonna have another piece of bait on, get right back in there, and see what we could do. I think he's moving. I think we have another bite on here. Not 100% sure. Because there's a little bit of wind today, so it's a little bit harder to tell, but. Oh yeah. Where's my line at? Oh wow. Oh no! Oh, Just no. missing that. Oh, sucks. That once again was another bowfin. And that one was about 
The first one was probably about 13 inches. That was probably 15. So we're just using cut perch. And I guess the bow, bow fin are out today. Here's the rig I'm using. Sinker, bank sinker. This is a size one aught hook. And a piece of cut perch. Alright, I think there's a fish on here. My line went really slack, so... Oh, there's a big load of absolutely nothing. Alright, there we go. We got another bite on here. I'm gonna wait till he takes it one more time. There he goes. Alright, get him in the net this time. Oh yeah, I can definitely do that. I don't know. When I see him, I'm gonna stick him. That's a little bit nicer one. Get him here, get him here. I'll let him run a little bit. Oh, don't do that, Bofin. Bad idea. Trying to keep the line tight. Nope, nope, nope. Go down, go down, go down. The hook's right there. Let's get him. Okay, yes. That's a nice bow fin. Let's get him over here and we'll take a peek. Perfect hook set, right in the corner of the mouth. That's right where I like him. Yeah. Okay, cool. Alright guys, so here's another bow fin. This one's a little bit nicer. That's about an average size one, I'd say. Probably about 20, 21 inches. He probably weighs a good two and a half pounds. He is really fat. These things, when they fight, they're just basically meat torpedoes. They have th so much fight in them, and they are strong. So that makes for a good fight, and they're absolutely delicious to eat. But this guy's definitely going back in the water, and we're gonna get into some more. Let's get this meat torpedo back in the water. Give him a second. And he is 20 inches. We measured him. So he looks like he's ready to go to me. So. Just hooked up. Oh, I'm, I'm hooking up too. I'm hooking up too. All right, let's not cross. All right, mine's here. Oh, yeah. lost him. I lost him. All right, I'll land yours. I think it's a little guy. Where you at? Bring him in, bring him in. There we go. There we go. That's a meat torpedo right there. <laughs> Look at him A go. floppy one. Yeah. That's a nice, it's a, it's a good size, like decent size. It's all right. Let's hold him up. Oh yeah. All right, let David deal with his fish. Awesome. And I got to cast back in there because I just lost one. I don't know if he's on here. He bit it and he pulled and now it's slack. Oh yes. I need a net, I need a net. Actually no I don't, it's a bullhead. There he goes. It's over here, it's over here. That's a good one. That's a good one. Nope, no, I don't. Put it in, put it in. Perfect. Here we go, guys. Another bow fin. Let's check him out. I think this is the biggest one of the day. What do you say, David? Close. Close? I don't know. It's, it's one of those uh, nicer ones. It is. Don't bite. Oh, by the way, you also shouldn't stick your hand in a bowfin's mouth because they have a lot of teeth. But I'm a professional, so... 
He didn't like that one. He didn't like my joke. All right, let's get this hook. 19 inches. That's a probably about two and a half pounds, two and a half, three. So that's a good one. And slide him back in. And he's off. I got one too. I got one though. There oh, we go. that's doubled we doubled up. We doubled up. We did it, guys. I got a little jam. I mean, uh, forehead. Head. I have to get this dude in the net. Oh yeah, let me get the net for you. Right, yeah, you this one looks a little bit nicer. Bring him over. Let me see him. I'm trying to keep the hook tight. Okay, okay. You ready? Oh, oh. Ooh. Wait, wait. Stay down. Okay, but get it in, get it in. Got him. Oh, yes. All right, guys. We got another bow fin for today. This one. This one looks like the biggest one for today, I think. Let's measure. I think, yep. I put my tape measure away, so. There he is. The bow fin just flopped back into the water as soon as I got the hook out, but that's okay. Didn't get a picture, didn't get a measurement. We're going to estimate it at about 20 inches. So that's all for today's video. Thank you so much for watching. Drop a like and comment if you enjoyed. Until next time, goodbye, good luck, and good fishing.